Hello everyone, this is Rehan back again with another video. And in this video, I'm going to show you how to install the, uh, you know, Android P recent screen like this in your Samsung Galaxy S7 Edge. As you guys know, I have a Samsung Galaxy S7 Edge phone and also an S8 phone. Uh, I tried this on the S8 and uh, and uh, this in this video, I'm going to show you to how to do it on the S7 Edge and uh, i'm going to try it on a couple of other devices like uh, samsung galaxy j7 j5 and uh, a series phones as well so i mean i will also test it meanwhile you guys can also test it and let me know whether it works or not works for you so currently the android version whichever i am using is uh, let me show you it's android 8.00 which is a oreo version so oreo is also having a similar to the lollipop recent screen uh, if you guys remember it will be like a card card style it will, it will be like a card style so it will be scrolling like this but since i have already installed this uh, uh, android p recent screen i don't want it to revert it back as i as you as i like this uh, as i like this animation really well and it is also really cool and it's very stylish okay so if you if you guys also want to know how to install this and now let's let me show you how to do that okay so first you need to download two apps from the uh, from the link in the description below so these are the two apps which you need to download one is the samsung task changer and another one is the good luck 2018 uh, 1.0.0026 and more okay so these two apps are just released one day before and i installed last night and now i am now i am actually i wanted to share this with you guys as well okay so after you download that so i have already downloaded it it's a it's not any spyware or you know like it's not any uh, like you know it's not a third party application that have virus or anything because this is actually released by samsung itself i can i can show you guys that where it goes yeah this is actually released by the samsung and uh, samsung electronics yeah, by itself so, so you guys don't have to worry that this is any third party or this will hang your phone or anything obviously this is a preview version this is not an official version uh, so like you know uh, this won't be as perfect as android p but it is 90 percent it is perfect as uh, is for the android p okay so uh, so like so after you install this app so the step is very straight guys so you just need to click on it and first you need to install the google lock 2018 okay once this installation is completed you need to install the the uh, samsung recent uh, task changer that's all let the installation get completed okay and give done and um, you need to install the task changer so once these two installation is completed you don't have to do any more else step uh, so you just scan you know when you press the recent screen the, uh, the the vertical scrolling uh, cards will be changed to this horizontal scrolling cards so let me show you it so uh, so currently this step is working on samsung galaxy s7 edge and s8 and uh, i have i also have a j7 on which i will do a testing and let you know guys whether it's working or not in the comments below and if you guys uh, you guys can also can test it on your samsung devices or non samsung devices if it works just let me know in the comments below that will be helpful for the other people as well so once these two installation is completed uh, you guys can you know once i once i press the recent screen so i uh, this uh, i'll get this horizontal scrolling card style this is really cool guys and this is also uh, very very stable and i really like this look as well and let me show what are the features it has so if you press and hold this icon you guys can see that it has open in pop-up view app info lock app and hide content so it so not only by look wise it's it's giving us the features of android p but it is also uh, but it also retain the you know uh, the multi window feature which we had uh, in, the, in, the, in the old recent screen so if you press the open in pop-up view it will open it in the pop-up view okay so so, I, so I, I think i can open many as many as apps i want 
so wow guys this is like a windows operating system now let me try opening one more app oh my mistake oh i think i can't open more than two apps oh yeah i can but no, i don't know i don't know i can't even open the instagram app let me try on whatsapp oh my god guys i can able to open three apps at once sound it's really cool okay so this is how we need to reopen it which is really cool guys <laughs> so if i press the home button all three will get minimized and even if you want to open one by one you can you can just click on this icon you can reopen it again it's cool guys uh, I, I i recommend you guys to try it out yeah, even even another one feature i saw it uh, is that lock app which was also there and uh, this is a part of uh, android oreo so you know like uh, uh, so if you press lock app and if you press close all all the apps will be closed except the app whichever i i I actually locked it okay so this is also one of the new features of android oreo i think uh, because i didn't notice this on the android nougat or marshmallow okay you can also unlock it and uh, and if you want to hide the content you can also hide the content as well so you know like if someone is if you are given your phone if you go to recent screen they can't able to see the content okay you can also show the content and you can also go to app info I can see the what are the what are the permissions and other app application information. So these are the things that you can do from the recent screen. Okay, so that's all, guys, about this uh, uh, about how to install this uh, Samsung Task Changer for your Samsung Galaxy S7 Edge and for your other Samsung devices. I hope you guys like this video, and if you guys like this video, just leave a thumbs up. And stay subscribed to my channel for more videos. And I see you guys in the next video. Bye bye.